What's going on guys, it's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and in today's Destiny video I'm bringing you guys my entire loot and results from the Prison of Elders. Now I played the Prison of Elders as we all know over a week ago. Uh, I played it twice, I ran through from start to finish twice, only got a loot for the first time I ran it as the second time I was helping out a friend. In this video I'm going to show you guys exactly what I got in terms of loot results from the Prison of Elders. Now we played it on the level 32 version. The last boss was Valus Traog. Once we beat him, you are rewarded a key which you then take into the treasure room. Something at this precise moment in time I am not allowed to show you guys, but I am allowed to show you guys my rewards. I got a shit ton of things, but we're gonna start with the armor core. Now the armor core is something you use to purchase armor from Valus the Loyal on the reef because he is the vendor for the prison of elders so you take this armor core which you are rewarded you take it to him and you can buy the armor he has for that set week i then got the cow winter's hood which is a class item for my hunter which i'll show you guys on screen now looking super sexy i mean to be honest i only took a quick look at it and then I left it and completely forgot about it. I weren't wearing it in trials or anything else, which I wish I would have because it would have made me look pretty sweet. I got three strange coins also, and I also got something called the Royal Amethyst. Now, don't quote me on the pronunciation of that. I'm usually wrong, and I probably am about this one. I have no idea what this is, but I'm guessing it's something to do with the Queen. Uh, probably a material I can trade with her somehow. But at this precise moment in time, I am definitely 100% unsure. I also got the Payment 6, which is the Queen's Pulse Rifle. I did use this in the Trials of Osiris, something I actually enjoyed using. But it was a Pulse Rifle at the end of the day. You either like them or you don't. I know though, when we did have the Queen with Destiny back, back, back in the day, when it basically first came around, this was actually a rare weapon. It seems as though now it's been upgraded to a legendary. The exact same weapon was a rare. Okay, moving on. The main thing which I got from the Prison of Elders, which you guys may have already seen a video on, was the new 334 slash 365 attack Galahorn. I am the first in the world to get this weapon, and I mean, I was gobsmacked. When I saw this pop up on screen, I was absolutely gobsmacked, along with a few other YouTubers that were surrounding me in the room and Bungie staff. They just couldn't believe it. I got the Galahorn on the first in the world, confirmed by Bungie. Absolutely epic. And if you guys missed my video covering this 365 attack Galahorn, I'll link that in the video description as well so you can check it out. But guys, that is what I got from the Prison of Elders, my first time running. The loot rewards I got, now like I said we ran this under level 32 version of the Prison of Elders. There's also a 28, 34 and 35 which I'm sure you'll get even greater stuff and more shit for doing so. But guys that is it for another Destiny video, if you guys enjoyed it, if you could leave a like I would appreciate the support. If you guys are new to my channel and enjoy daily Destiny, be sure to subscribe, I've got a shitload of House of Wolves coverage to come. Thanks for stopping by as always and peace out until next time, peace!